Hello everyone, I'm Lee Mobile welcome to 2016's Egg Hunt. Um, so as you guys can see, I do have the admin egg, and um, I honestly don't really want to make videos of me hunting egg when I play this game, because when I have, whenever I play egg hunts, I enjoy these with my friends, and if I can't do that, I don't know why my inventory is just cleared, bro, okay. Anyways guys, as you see here, I have all the eggs. But the nesting doll, where I think the nesting doll is either supposed to be here, yeah, like right there. It says I don't have it, but I actually do have it because I did actually try to do the glitch. So now I don't require the badge. Hopefully, once the um, actual version comes out, I can test if I can get the badge on the alt account. And if I delete the hat in the badge, I can get it back. Because I honestly don't want to risk that. But I do have the purple nesting doll. So that's cool. So I'm just gonna talk about this egg hunt because I honestly don't really wanna play me hunting for the. I don't really wanna play hunting these eggs. Look out the rocket eggs after me. But um, each egg is kind of unique in its way. It has its own different challenges and stuff. And I don't talk about it. The rocket egg here. Don't miss a egg. You have to try to dodge it. I've done it before though. I've done it once. But how I got it is that someone dodged it and landed like on my oh okay that's great thank you thank you egg but, not. but how I got it is that someone someone dodged it and it landed on the side closer to me so yeah okay you know what I'm not gonna go there so I just did get all the eggs I got the last egg I needed which was the um which was the um Dinah the bone egg that's what I needed the dice egg. What it does is that you have to choose one of these things, so yeah. This is kind of for the people that don't see it, and also there is going to be spoilers to the egg hunt. So if you already don't know anything and you don't, and you want to keep it like that, then um, just don't watch, I guess. Like, I honestly don't care. But, um, yeah. So, my experience with the egg hunt was actually really fun. Internal me, internal and I, we um, actually both bought the egg hunt. It was like 400 Robux. You can say if it's wasted if you want to, but I enjoyed it. And, um, yeah, it was like 400 Robux. And it was kind of, this is like a test right now. The city's not really unlocked, so I don't have all of the eggs for the actual game. But I do have, um, all of the eggs that's in the beta. So I believe it's like half of the eggs now in the game. And the rest of the eggs are in the city that I need to get, or, yeah. Or just not spawning in. So yeah, there are going to be like really rare eggs. And I'm getting a web server for it. So yeah, I'll make another video when I complete those eggs. And talk about how I, how much fun I had. But um, this is the barn right here. There's a staff. I guess I need to pick this. Oh wait, oh, okay. Um, I never went to the barn. So why do I have one fossil? I, no, I never went to that place. So I don't, I don't know why I have one fossil now. Um, but yeah. So I got all the eggs. No one really, this egg was kind of a little bit hidden. I didn't know this was in the beta until I went into the water and I actually found it. Actually, no, until I went into the water. And I have another rocket egg coming after me. It's gonna smash all oh, that was so close to. Oh. Oh god. You. God dang it, rocket egg. You lose gas. Oh god, no. Sorry. Sorry, bro. I'm gonna let you hit against the wall. Yeah, hit. Boom. Okay. God, the rocket eggs do get annoying after a while because, like, you see how much you're in the map? That one spawns almost, like, instantly. These ones are, like, surrounded there, so... Yeah, the rocket eggs almost make it hard to get some of this stuff. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna go check out the second island. We'll go to the second island because yeah second island I didn't really spend that much time in second island as in the main island though because um yeah there's not that much I mean there are eggs in the main island and those eggs in the second island but um second islands mainly like the co-op island I guess because most things there oh god the boats not working I um I have to swim now. I guess I have to swim now. No, what? No, what? No, 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 I don't have to swim now. I can go into that portal there. But the second island, that's where, like, 
most of the co-op stuff happened, I guess, because there's the teamwork egg thing now, and then there's the sword fighting stuff there. So, um, yes, you can't really get, like, your own private VIP server for this stuff. You actually need to have, like, an actual server. And, um, it encourages people to not go in VIP servers, because things like the cat egg. Because your friends, the only way to get the cat egg, I believe, is if someone has the gun and starts shooting it. And then the cat egg will randomly spawn. So these eggs are interesting. As you can't get caught by the light or you'll get turned to stone. But yeah, you can get them. Sorry if the game's not loading that fast. Like really, this is kind of, this sucks. But um, right. This guy's gonna ask for who gave you them and they don't know. Um, My friend saw it spawn in the admin left. So I don't, I actually don't know who spawned my admin egg. I think Eternal knows, but um, I honestly don't know. So this is the pedestal, the, the stuff for the co-op egg. Um, I believe it's not supposed to be like this back here, but um, okay. So what you do is you just stand on one of those. You have to stand in it in an order. Not that much people know about that. It has to be in an order. So yeah, not that much people really know about that. And... So this is a PvP area, where, um, I, honestly, I'm just talking about crap that you guys don't even need to know. But, um, PvP area, fight dragons. Mm, that guy really wants the Eggman. More than anything. Yeah, it, the, the hat is kind of, like, it, it gets annoying. Like, the only reason why I got it is because, probably because all of the servers are not big. Because it's not the actual egg hunt, but, yeah. You do get all the hats. Half these hats are layer, but I won't get like things like this until the city gets released on March 22nd So I do have some more eggs to get So I'm excited about that that I can continue the hunt But right now I have all of the eggs that are possible to get until the game's out of beta so yes, so Like two days ago there was a way to get into the city which opened up a city area so, um, he kind of, that, that, that was a leak, pretty much. Um, the stuff you could find was, like, a Q20, D, no, D20, and then a boot, and then you could just walk around and you can see what the wizard egg needed. So what the wizard egg needs is a staff and then a bucket of milk. So as long as you have a staff and a bucket of milk, you can just instantly go to the wizard egg and then you'll get it. So, yes. And the farmer egg was also there. The farm egg was also like two days ago, but he did remove it because he needs car keys that are in the city. He also needs two nails in a haystack, which um I could never find that, so yeah, that's gonna be a problem if he asks for that again. But yeah, I'm gonna go into the cave. So the the only good thing about the cave is that it gives you the dinosaur egg, but it takes a while to get it. So I recommend you just go on and YouTube and get a playlist. By the way, this phone doesn't work. I recommend to go on YouTube and get a playlist. It's easy on the VIP server because you can just walk back and forth and get the egg. But um, it's harder when there's a lot of people on the game because if they take the bones, then it gets really. It could take longer. Just because they're trying to get the bones, so I recommend you not join a big server. Make sure to that people aren't in there. Keep walking back and forth. Or if you want to check on check in time to time while you're hunting, that's okay too. But um, I don't know if you'll get that fast enough. But you can do that if you want to. If that helps you feel a lot better, I'm gonna go back here. So my experiences with the egg hunt so far, like I said, the city, the whole city glitch was amazing because. Like, on the first day, I could go in the city. city's not done, though. Um, but there's a secret, little secret thing back there. And this is where the... This is sometimes where the fourth egg piece spawns. Not that much people know about that. But there's a little secret thing right there. And there are some glitches, by the way. I actually found out a glitch that I don't really want to tell anyone. Because it needs to be kept in the game. Yeah. So sorry about that. I want to keep it in the game, so I don't want to really tell anyone. But you see this here? Um, there's this thing back here. Um, donate 50k. Wow. GG. Um, I don't know what this thing is for. I don't know if it's part of a real egg or not, but, um, yes, that, that, that is cool, I guess. Um, I can show you this one, this one thing here. It's not really, um, 
a glitch, but it is mainly an out of bounds area. So it's under the water here. I don't know if he patched it yet though. But yeah, it's right there. So this isn't a secret area. It's not even supposed to be here. Which is cool, I guess. We're finding the secret areas before. Okay. Now jump up to the top and boom. You're now in the secret area. You can go and hang out here with your friends. This doesn't give you access into the city, guys. Don't think it will give you access into the city. It won't. So, yeah. Got it. There's been literally tons of people asking for ask access into the city. And um, how to get into the city. But I always give them the same thing. The same message. There's no way to get into the city. By the way, if you go under the map, there's a way that you can look for. There's a way that there's eggs. There's like line of eggs under the map. But, um, yeah. So, that's great, I guess. So, um, I've had a couple rough experiences as well. On egg hunts, everyone's gonna have a rough experience. Only because these are actually li living people playing the game and taking eggs that you want. So, if you see an egg and someone's gonna take it, then you're gonna get mad at them. Because that's what we do. So, um, if you don't get mad at them, props to you. Because, um, that's a good thing. You're not yelling at a player because of a virtual egg. But then again, almost everyone does that in Roblox egg hunt. So, yeah. So, um, the thing is, my experience is, someone tried to, I mean, this isn't really a thing, but, um, yesterday, someone thought the city glitch was actually a real thing. I kept telling him it's not, and, um, he was like, no, it is a real thing. Trust me, guys. I'm like, dude, stop trying. You're not gonna get over. He's like, nope, I'm gonna get over. I'm the glitch master. He never got over. He got mad at me, and he took an egg piece I needed, and then he never gave it to us, and then he deleted it. That's not the bad thing. I actually did end up leaving the server after that only because I couldn't find the fourth egg piece ever again because of that. But I eventually got the teamwork egg. So, yeah. That was kind of like a bad... That was kind of like a mean move for him to do because, like, honestly, the thing about the teamwork egg is that it's not really teamwork. You find an egg piece, someone finds an egg piece, you guys meet up, boom. You don't really get that much teamwork. I mean, you do respond to each other, like, who has this piece, who has that, and then you find out, and then, yeah, but it's not really teamwork. It's just seeing who has a piece, and if they have a piece, they're lucky, and then, yeah, if you guys have duplicate pieces, or one the person screwed, depending on whoever made the, whoever went there first. So, yeah. Um, my favorite egg, I guess, is the admin egg. Yes, that is my favorite egg. I mean, the cat egg is okay. I didn't really enjoy the cat egg that much. This egg is also another one of my favorites. Rocket egg, that egg. And then... The, the normal egg is also cool as well. Normal egg right there. They finally made a normal egg, which that's great. And yeah. Um... Strawberries grow. If you guys don't understand that. But, um... There's more experiences. Like, um... The PvP of, you know, I've been fighting and I got the egg once. I... I was killing a tunnel, and we were all fighting, and then I just went, like, I didn't even, I was like, I didn't even expect to, myself to get that egg that time, and I just go up to someone, and I kill him, drops egg, and I'm like, wow, GG me, and yeah, um, oh yeah, this is a cool thing, once again, if you don't want to get spoiled, walk away, but um, yes, you can go pick up all the eggs, and they all go into this corner, this is the best one you can do, because I, I, for sure, they just go, I know they all just go up into this corner, so it's so easy to get the eggs here because they all just drop into this corner. But the cool thing is you pick up these mini eggs. It's like a mini egg hunt, which I think that was the point. This is a rotten egg. It's not a real egg. It's a fake. So, yeah, when you step on it, that happens. And it's not great at all. And an empty potion. Not that much people. I don't think that much people know how to get the empty potion. This rocket's going to hit itself against the... Ledge, unless I don't know where it went. Oh god, oh, okay, yeah, it hit itself against the ledge. But, um, to get the hidden potion, I don't, I'm gonna show you guys how to get the hidden potion because, yeah. To get the um, empty potion, what you have to do is go to the, um, graveyard inside my door. I know I'm not gonna show you. But, um, there's not that much really to talk about to this, about this game. Like, um, I haven't really had that much good experiences, I guess, once the actual account comes out, and once I start helping my friends and such, and I will. But it's been a great experience to actually go and test this game, even though if I did buy this. But it's been so fun to just play this game, and it was the best. Was it worth the 400 Robux? Uh, I kind of think that's a little bit high-priced, but I guess 
It's so people don't get in. Now there are a lot of people yelling about the price when they get in their game. They're like, we, I paid 400 Robux for a broken game. Now, half of the Roblox community don't want, know what the heck beta means, if that if that's what they're saying, to be honest. Because, um, they say we're the beta testers, so you're buying something just because you want to get the egg instead of testing it. Now, I did buy it, well, everyone bought it just so they can get the eggs. But I, I've always kept in mind that since this game is broken, it's not out yet, and it's not the full version, because then the full version, the city's done. This is just the whole beta version, but, um... Yeah, it's not out yet, and people are still complaining how this game is broken. And it's not done yet. I don't know, Roblox has no clue what beta even means. At all. So anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Someone's shooting cat cannons, and... I wish they, um, had a black cat instead of the orange cat, because you know how I like to have a black... You know how I have a black cat tail and such, that would be cool. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'll see you guys, um, I don't know when my next video is going to be. Because the weekend, I just like to, um, keep it slow. Not make that much videos. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.